welcome to everyone in this video we continue the part of the chapter amines today friends we have a very important reaction in this chapter hoffman bromamide degradation reaction commonly we call is a hoffman bromination reaction this reaction is to prepare the different amines especially primary amines so how to prepare sir by using the amine this is an amide already known in the last reaction is commonly called acid amide when this amide undergoes bromination amide undergoes bromination in presence of alkaline medium in presence of alkaline medium degradation which helps to take place in alkaline medium i repeat when acid amide undergoes bromination in presence of alkali or either basic medium to form the products to form degradation degradation means that they will remove all of the carbonyl carbon the carbonyl carbon number now kadme maadre carbon number must be decreases and the carbon number same the kadme maadodakke degradation of the kalitare matre this carbonyl carbon is removed as an product is potassium carbonate you can see and then this bromine is removed as an form of compound is potassium bromide kbr here to be a total potassium is four you can see this is h and then to remove this compound now we have r and h the balance now carefully balance with you know hydrogen so here two two plus four six hydrogens there are only two now we require two h to balance with an oxygen now this is your primary amine here you remember it's very important when amine undergoes bromination in presence of alkaline medium to form primary amine potassium carbonate potassium bromide and water if you change here koh in the place of koh any oh the compounds are sodium carbonate sodium bromide this is the general reaction of hoffman so based on this hoffman we can prepare so many different compounds This is a CH3CONH. You know this is your acetamide. Acetamide undergoes same bromination in presence of alkaline medium. Can you change here? Yes, in the place of KOH, now we can use any of it also. The product degradation means removal of this carbonyl carbon. Carbonyl carbon. Can you see the picture? Now this is now this is a sodium carbonate. Now this is sodium bromide and to reason a water. I mean, you know, two molecules. So this is a sodium can be balanced with the here too. It requires a four here. Now it remains CH3 and NH2. This is a CH3 NH2. This is your methyl amine. This is a very simple preparation of amines from the amine. Keep in your mind, friends. Here the carbon number must be decreases. Descending of series in chemistry, organic chemistry there are two reactions: ascending reaction and descending reaction. Here descending reaction will take place. The two carbon is converted into one carbon, which decreases in the carbon number by using Hoffman. You can change the amines. You can get the different amines, especially primary amines from Hoffman bromide. Carefully, you have to practice with different amines to get the different. Amines, yes, this example out of you. It's a two marks question. Keep yourself and keep practicing things. And after this uh, Hoffman bromide, yes, you come across this Hoffman bromide. Now our target is a uh, very important. Only the preparation of aliphatic amines. Yes, which method helps to prepare only aliphatic? Why cannot be aromatic? Then you will see reaction. Gabriel thalamide. Gabriel thalamide reaction. Keep in mind, thalamide. Yes. So thalamide is an derivative of thalic acid. First, if you want, when you make a little bit of a name, sir, this is your thalic acid. Yes. Thalic acid is undergoes amino lysis. This is amino lysis NH3. 
this here it is a release of these OH and this OH is combined with and a two hydrogen molecules. Here hydrogen to very here OH to very the release of two H two. Water with the sir, either way to it remains only an H. Now this is your compound C double bond O, C double bond O. Yes, now only remains N H. The name of this compound is a thalamine. Yes, please start it. Yes, by using this thalamine, how to prepare your minds? Very simply, you start carefully, friends. This is your thalamine. Thalamine. When this thalamine undergoes react with an alkali, yes, it is react with an alkali, it is like an alkyl. Once it react with an alkali, this H is combined with OH to release as an water to form an salt. To get it in a salt, this is benzene, C double bond O, C double bond O as it is. Now N retains C N and K. We call it as an potassium thalamine. Or commonly called as a salt, potassium thalate also. This is a formation of salt, potassium thalate. thalate. Yes, after this salt, we can treat it with yes, which we can treat it with corresponding alkyl alloy. And this alkyl alloy can remove this K as a potassium alloy. Alkyl alloy can attach. This is C double bond O. C double bond O, N, and this is what happens. Now, yes, it undergoes react with alkali. Friends, careful. Here, react with an alkali. There is a NaOH. Yes, careful. You have to remember. Yes, once it react with NaOH, I can consider two moles. Yes, it is the formation of R, N. These two hydrogen, this is R N H two. I repeat, R N combined with two hydrogen R N H two, your target is a primary. What it remains? The plus the remaining part remains. This is benzene as it is. C double bond O and C double bond O. And now we keep to ourselves. So O N A remains for the two molecules. O N A. As you already know, this is a potassium thalate. Now you can see that this is a sodium thalate. This is a salt in the form. With the help of this, we can use the repetition of the process. We are coming to the point. Thalamus is not the only one. Now we have the other thing. We are going to get the salt. The salt is the starting material. This is the process start. This is the alkali thalate. We are going to get. इंटरमीडियट बर्तदे प्रॉब्लमी जनरल जनरली प्रेमरी अमेन हेगी एक्सापल तक स्टार्ट ना वेरी सिंपली स्टार्ट विटेबल एक्सापल फॉर् दिस वेरी हेलफुल फॉर् युवर प्राक्टिस प्राक्टिस ना एक्सापल सर ना क्वेश्चन बढ़ते हे क्वेश्चन कौन हौ टू फॉर् मीथाइन 
how to form a methylamine using thalamine. Thank you. Thank you so much.